Disney has released the 6th and 7th episodes of The Bad Batch Season 3, and I thought they were... okay. Episode 6 focuses on a failed assassination attempt where Captain Rex gets to learn more information about the clones who have been taken in by the Empire, and when he learns that the Empire is still hunting Omega, he calls the Bad Batch crew in for some help. But they all get attacked by a secret Imperial operative, and a troop of clones commanded by Captain Wolf. And episode 7 picks up immediately after that, as the entire episode focuses on how Rex and the Bad Batch crew manage to get their way out of this mess. So the two episode arc was less about the Bad Batch themselves, and more about the larger picture, as it focused more on the clones in general. And that is totally fine, I just wasn't all that intrigued by the story being told here. Because we all know that the clones are being experimented on, we all know that plenty of clones are being held hostage on Tantus, we know that their blood is being used to create more clones of Emperor Palpatine, but it's taking a long ass time for our heroes to catch up with the information that we have. And that just made the stakes of this episode feel a little low and impersonal to me. Don't get me wrong, I do enjoy the world building, but my favorite parts in these two episodes were the smaller, more intimate moments. Like the interactions between Omega and Crosshair. Because I found their banter with one another to be absolutely priceless. So I wish that these two episodes were either smaller and more personal, or further along in developing the overarching plot. Either way, I don't think these were two bad episodes. My biggest issue probably comes from the depiction of the Imperial Operative, since I'm pretty sure that his true identity is going to be revealed to be Tech or somebody else that we already recognize. And I think that is a pretty unnecessary plot point to include in this series. But there are still several episodes left in the season, so I am interested in seeing where the story goes from here. I just wish the series would begin to pick up the pace a little bit. But I guess we'll see how I feel about the next episode of The Bad Batch when it comes out on Wednesday.